1947 in Missouri, USA. A little baby boy was born. He started on life's way. He grew fast and he grew strong. He worked the farm most every day. He was known to one and all as Jesse James. On the day the Red Lakes came and tried to take away his land, he was only in his fifteenth year. He wasn't yet a man, and they beat him and they bruised him. But he vowed to make a stand And he swore to take revenge on them one day So with brother Frank and Cole and Jim The James Gang rode to town And they robbed the Yankees banks And then they shot those Yankees down Sheriff offered a reward for him the state's most wanted man and the words upon the poster read just kill him if you can and a so-called friend of Jesse's sat and hatched himself a plan. He was gonna rid the world of Jesse James. Jesse married his Zarelda and moved to another town. And Zarelda bore him children. So he swore he'd settle down. But as Jesse planned, his final raid a knock came on his door. Standing there was Robert Ford with a pearl handled forty-four, and he shot poor Jesse twice and left him dying on the floor. Then he strode away to claim his blood reward Friends came and carried Jesse's body to a hill outside the town and in a dusty little graveyard they laid poor Jesse down and Zerelda Stood there weeping in a long black widow's gown. In a long black widow's gown. In a long black widow's gown. In the long